Hello, this is Beautbox again. So for today, I have a different uh, video presentation that I'm going to show with you. So this time, I'm going to involve my kids to be a part of this video. So I hope you can stick around so they can see what is the video all about. And I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it. As I have said a while ago, my kids is going to be a part of this video so i'm going to give you a hint now this video is all about mexican snacks so this is one of those and the name of this one is tortilla chips so that's the first one the second one is pumpkin it chicharrones so we're going to find out what will be the taste for that one next is <clears throat> Doritos, a taco flavor. So I'm sure you all had this before. Okay. Next is caramel corn, or they call it alboroto. And of course, the last one is this one. So they call this Takis uh, Fuego. Fuego means a fire. So we're going to find out later on. So again, this video is all about a. Uh, Mexican snack will be uh, uh, ranked by the Filipino kids. So we're going to find out if they'll be able to rank them in accordingly. So again, so don't forget to, uh, to watch the entire video, okay? Hi, my name is Romeo Lobodeses. I'm 10 years old. And my hobbies are doing Taekwondo and um, playing Roblox, also drawing too. Hello, my name is Ariel Lovedesis and um, I'm 11 years old. I'm about to turn 12. And my favorite hobbies are reading manga and um, drawing and <laughs> drawing and painting. Hi, my name is Fiona Lovedesis. I am 13 years old and my favorite hobby is diving. Okay, so do you have any idea why you're here today? Because we're, I'm going to taste Mexican food and I'm going to rate it 1 through 5. To taste some Mexican foods? Um, to taste the Mexican snacks and hopefully taste something new and get out of my comfort zone. Okay, so let's start, okay? Okay, are you familiar with this snack? Mm -hmm. Okay, try one or maybe two. Try to taste it. Okay, what can you say while you're eating it? It, it kind of tastes a little like flour. Mm -hmm. And I think there's they added a little salt, but it's still good. It's kind of like, um, it leaves a bit of crumbs, so... I don't recommend this eating it on your bed or like if you don't want it your mat um, like on a carpet. But I mean, it would be good for salsa and like an appetizer. It it would be good with um, spinach cheese, which is really good. And um, I like it a lot. It's just it's really plain and like bland and doesn't have that much flavor to it, so. It tastes bland and it's plain, but, um, it would taste good with some, uh, some sort of sauce to go with these tortilla chips. It tastes like um, fried, fried chips with salt, and it tastes good still. Okay. I like it, and it doesn't taste bad at all. Okay, so if you're going to rank one through five, what rank are you going to give? There's a paper and a pen right there, so you can use one. Okay, and then show it to me. Okay, 
Show it to me. What is your rank? Oh, 3.5. Why did you say 3.5? It's because, like, it doesn't really have that much taste, and I can almost taste a lot of flour. Because I really don't like plain and, um, I don't like plain and, um, plain and, like, not flavor, <laughs> flavorful chips. Because, like, I don't really, like, like, I don't, I don't savor it the most because, yeah, I don't really like it. it and it's kind of too salty at the same time, so it doesn't have any spice or, like, it would be good with dip, but that's the only thing good about it. So, my rating for this is a three. The reason why I rated uh, the tortilla chips a three is because you can't go wrong with the Mexican staple because, um, as I know, I've tasted this before. Um, I wasn't really, it wasn't paired with uh, salsa or something or any sauce that I could go with. So that's why I rated it a three. But it still tastes good as a snack as well. How about this one? Have you tried this? Mm -mm. Okay. It's hot, spicy, great. These are bacon et chicharron, hot and spicy. 70 calories. Um, It's really spicy, which I like, and um, very crunchy. It doesn't leave any crumbs on your hands. Only leaves like a little bit of spice, but you can just like rub it off. And um, it mostly fills up to the bag. It tastes good. Um, I have tasted chicharron because my parents have brought it before and um, I don't know, Filipino people like chicharron. And also, it is really good. I never tasted like it's spicy. The spiciness was mild and it fits perfectly with the chips. Okay, so if you're going to give them a rank, uh, give me a rank now. Or, uh, yeah, from one to five. Well, it's because it's not five yet because it's it's spicy, but I like chicharrones, so I'll give it a four. Okay, that's good. It is a 3.9 because it's not good, but at the same time, it's not bad. And the good side kind of like um, takes over the majority of the bad side. So, um, and it has more flavor than the um, last one. Um, so this one gets like a higher ranking than uh, la um, the plain one. Um, I rated the chicharrones a four because I have tasted chicharron. They added uh, a little twist, adding spice. I never really thought of that. And the spice was just about right. It was mild and that's why I picked a four. Doritos taco flavor. Okay. What's the taste? It actually tastes like tacos. And then? And it's Doritos. I don't know how they did that, but it's pretty cool. Okay. It's 
supposed to be taco flavor, but it tastes like <laughs> burritos. I mean, they kind of are the same, but like, I know what burritos and tacos taste like. But this one tastes like burritos and it's just like tacos flavor, so. But it's really good, it's really good. Taco flavor. Let me taste some taco flavor. What I could say about the Doritos taco flavor, it is really good. It actually tastes like a taco. Even though I haven't eaten a taco as many times as before, it does really taste like a taco. And the flavors uh, mix very well together. So what grade are you going to give or rank? Oh, five, why? Because I, I very like tacos and Doritos too. Okay. Why is that 3.4? This one's a lower score because I was actually expecting like tacos, um, like all the f like all the flavor from the taco, but instead I got like bean <laughs> bean burrito taco uh, bean burrito kind of taco. Um, and I really liked the packaging. It was very cute. Um, I liked how it was like very much spice, has very much seasoning. And yeah, I thought this was fake at first. So my eyes deceived me for, for a second. I rate these Doritos. I rate these Doritos taco flavored chips a five out of five because it is the best. I could eat this every day with water and it would taste super good. And also, the flavors combined taste really good. It tastes like a taco itself. And this is a very good innovation. <laughs> they are caramel corn. Caramel corn, okay. a lot of caramel, but I really don't really taste the corn. Alboroto. This is Alboroto, and it's caramel corn. So, I'm gonna be trying four of them at the same time. Oh shit, oh shit. This is four, right? Yeah, this is four, I'm gonna be trying them out. This is really good. Okay, so there's a lot of things I like about this one. It's very sweet, and um, the, the calories are 130 calories. And um, it's very sweet, it's very chewy, so like, if you have braces, I mean, it's not like it's gonna get stuck in braces, but I recommend it for people with braces. It's very crunchy, it's not like, I mean, not really chewy, but it's like crunchy and chewy at the same time. The texture of it is like really smooth, and then um, it feels nice on your tongue. And then um, they're like really small, and it feels like it feels um, three fourths up to the bag. So that's good about it. This is called the caramel corn, caramel flavor corn. These taste really good. Um, I like the combo with corn and caramel tastes really good itself. And I would like to eat it, you know, as a snack. It would be really good. So what uh, rank are you going to get from one to five? Okay. 
Wow, 4.5. Because the caramel, uh, they didn't add too much caramel, but it's, and I can't really taste the corn because uh, I think the ingredient wasn't corn. Mm. Or, but I still like it because uh, the caramel, it, it really tastes good. I don't know how to explain it, but it's very good. Most of the brands with chips don't really fill it up to like the most of it, so. It's a 4.5. Okay, so um, I literally love everything about it. I love the packaging, it's really cute. But like at first I was like, the reason why I didn't give it like an all the way a five, because I thought it was gonna be like really bad. Because <laughs> look at the packaging. It looks, it looked like Cocoa Puffs and I was like, I thought it was gonna take, taste like chocolate, which is good, but like, it, I don't know, chocolate corn, I don't know, it doesn't look right to me. And um, I just like the flavor. I rate this a three because it does taste like these um, rice cakes that I have tasted before. Um, I have like, I feel like I have tried these before and the flavors are kind of the same. So I rate this a three. Talkies. What do you call this? Takis. Okay. Try it, Takis. It's like spicy taste at the end, but a lemon taste at first. Okay. I am really excited for this one. I've had these, I have these chips for like class, like in recess and lunch. Mm. I would have like, I would like have one bag um, of Takis, like little ones, like those. Um, and then I would persuade my mom to get me Takis whenever we're at Target. But like sometimes it works, sometimes not. Depends on our mood. So I'm really excited to um, taste it again. I'm taking the super big one, Taki one. Because <laughs> I really am a Takis fan. I love Takis. So well, a little seasoning you have. It's very good. It's very good. Um, it's actually spicy. Like fuego. Spicy. Really good. Like sometimes they would come in different sizes. Sometimes it would be small, sometimes it would be thin, sometimes thick, sometimes more like more spice in it. Um when my dad bought these I was super excited to taste it. And um I like the lime flavor, so it's good. And um, I loved it a lot. These are the Taki chips, uh, the Fuego Fiesta size, and I have two of these before. These taste really good. Um, I think my uh, spiciness tolerance have improved because last time I tasted these were a while ago and I would literally chug down water after I ate these. But these taste really good. I could taste the lime and the spiciness from the chili and it's really good. Okay, what uh, rank are you going to give? Well, it's because of the taste. It's the, what you call this? The lime, the lime taste and the spicy taste. In the middle, there's another thing that I, I really can't explain. Like maybe it's Doritos or maybe Taki, I mean, not Takis, I mean like Cheetos. It has 
has a it has a very different taste at the middle. Mm-hmm. It is a five point five. Finally, a five. Okay, I know. The reason why I give this a five is because it's really it's different from the others. Like most of these chips say, um, like it's like spicy vinegar. It um it's this kind of like um flavor. It's this kind of flavor. And um, most of them, I didn't really see the f- most, like some of the flavor in it. But this one, I could tell, I, I could taste the lime in it. I could taste like the hot chili pepper in it. Definitely the hot chili pepper. I could taste the tortilla chips in it too. Like, it's all in one. It's like three in one. So that's why I gave it like a five. It's just like really good. That's like a little talkie stain over there. I rate this snack a five out of five because who doesn't love Takis? Um, and also I rate this because I haven't tasted this in a while and I feel like I should be eating this <laughs> most of the time. But then again, that, that would hurt my tummy. But I still rate this a five out of five. Good snack, I could taste many of the flavors together that were in the package and I love the snack. So now, you're done with those Mexican snacks. So which one do you prefer the most? Uh, which one do you think? Oh, do you want that one? Okay, go get it. And then tell me, explain more on that one. Okay, why you, you picked that one? It's because it really tastes like a taco, and you didn't have to, have to put any ingredients in there. It's it's like um, it's powdered or something. The taste on the Dorito, it's like it's powdered. That's what I like about it. It's very good. It tastes like a taco. Okay. That's... Takis. Okay. So Takis. Okay. Tell me more. Why did you uh, pick Takis? Because okay. you could taste the flavor in it. Okay. Exactly. More than the others. Because like. You you could taste um, like what it actually says on the like the chip bag. Like most of these don't even match the flavoring at all, except this one. This one is kind of it. But like you could taste it really good, and it's really really good. So I recommend this to people. But if you eat too much, and then your teeth might get red, or your tongue might get red. So it was really good. I like this one. I still like these either way. Maybe if I'm not in the mood for spicy stuff, I could still eat this and I would be very happy. And I'm happy with all the snacks given to me all over here. And this is the best in my opinion. Finally, our kids already uh, made their decision. The, uh, the best uh, Mexican snacks are, of course, Takis. And also the other one is Doritos tortilla chips. So I'm pretty sure some other kids also love the other snacks that we uh, tried for your tasting. So don't get be offended. But these are our kids' uh, opinion, and this is based on their preferences and the taste that they uh, prefer. So I think Takis. This is my first time to uh, to try this one, and also Doritos taco flavor. As a matter of fact, I've been here in the U.S. I haven't tried this uh, kind of snack, but this is the first time. So, so far it tastes good. So, actually, I already tasted all of those snacks, but these two are really stand out. So, if you get a chance, go to any Mexican stores or any grocery store. Try to find these two snacks and then uh, taste it and then tell me what you, uh, you, what you think about it. So, you can uh, put that in your comment down below and then... Uh, We'll see and then I'm going to answer your uh, feedback as well. Again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on my YouTube channel. And my name is uh, Viewback. So again, uh, thank you so much. So please don't forget to uh, click the notification bell as well so that you can get uh, notified every time I have a new uh, video on uh, YouTube. And mabuhay and God bless us all. Okay, thank you so much. Happy Takis! Mmm. 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 This is really good. The flavor of this is also good.
I like this one, it's multiple flavors. This one only like two. So, if you're really into lemon uh, taste and spicy, go for it. If you're just kind of like mild, go for it as well. For this, okay? Thank you so much.